Hi, this is BB. Right now, I was I downloaded one of those um, thing that you measure your blood blood pressure with. Um, just for, I got a, a three day free trial. It's an app. My blood pressure, blood pressure, my pulse was fluctuating really, really. It went up to 130, 89, 88, 90 something, one something. It's like I it was right now. It's this, this, this is right now. I feel like my throat, like the bones in my throat, starting to break almost. My chest feels like it's it's just on this 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 whirring whirring sound in my ear. Somebody said they broke, uh, they broke the bone in in their ear. They're trying to break the bones in your ear. Now, again, you tell me what's happening here. Does this sound normal? For people who are extremely bad, people who have been bad for a long time. All right, something there. People who have been bad for a long time. You know, really bad, cantankerous, malicious per people. What is wrong with this? What what is the fascination? What are these people getting out of this? She's going crazy, of course. She doesn't know what to do because she might get a heart attack as well. I can feel that a tingling in my toes and in my fingers, and that's what they want. As soon as they see that happens, the game is on. I believe Kevin talks about the neural monitoring. Whatever it is, it's almost like a peep show. It's like you have family and friends, and they're all vying for who is in control of the monkey now, which is me. And they're all playing and fucking with the monkey. They're all trying to make the monkey dance. And then they're all waiting their turn now to, to make the monkey dance. This is what we've become. I don't understand this. Now, unless I'm mistaken, people are always talking about the last days. You tell me this has to be the last days. This doesn't make any other sense. She may get a heart attack before the night is over. I don't know. I don't know what to do. It's raining outside. I can't put her outside. I can't go outside as it's wet outside. This this is what they do. It's like sometimes you go outside and just, you know, get away from it. But now it's raining. So um, I can't go outside and she can't go outside. So they locked you in, basically. It, I don't know what to do. And I, I'm pretty sure I'm hearing a man grunting somewhere. There's a man grunting somewhere. And I don't know. You see, I'm getting agitated because I don't know what to do. This is, I, I, don't, I don't know what to do. If this was my house, I'd be all over that fucking attic. I don't know what to do. I'm so frustrated right now. And, and there's, there's some, some fucking monkey somewhere. They got me like the monkey. They're the fucking monkey hanging in the rafters. Like monkey ooga booga boogering up in the fucking rafters and the ceilings. Who the fuck climbs in ceilings and fuck with people? Like the like a puppeteer crawling behind ever everywhere you go, crawling and following you. That's a fucking monkey. That's a monkey. But they want you to pay for it, so whatever reason they have for crawling in your crawl spaces, in your attics, your basements, they have to make it well well they are disgruntled. The reason versus the reason plus the fact that it's a crawl space. That they have to resort to going to a crawl space. No, they have to make you pay for that. There's a reason and the fact that they're in a crawl space itself, which they're not happy with. So they have to make you pay for the fact that they're in a crawl space, if that makes sense. They got to treat you to like a piece of meat. Like they're, like they're hacking away at the piece of meat. These people... The U.S. government need to fucking do something about it. They really do.